may not be necessary. I just need something long and thin. Data Killer Part 14 Take a lap. I found a ruler. Great. Here we are. This ruler will do nicely. You did? I... Shut up. Not a single word more. Oscar, take him to the station once he's dressed. Yes, ma'am. Well, Anna, should I ask Uli to open it? No need. I'm ready to open it. Do you see this gap? It's big enough for us to use the ruler and move the latch up. A very simple lock to be... Uli, I'm going with you. Anybody here? Hello? I can hardly see a thing in here. This red dress looks so... Familiar? Yeah, I've seen it before. Let's shut off the hot water, otherwise there'll be more steam. Oh, God! Quickly, open the curtain. <gasps> Poor girl! This must have been Kiki. We were too late. Damn it to hell. Lieutenant, I... What is it, Uli? I found her passport. She's Nadia Schwetz. Nadia, the woman we were looking for. So it's confirmed. She was the girl from the X-ray used by the Dada killer. It would be awfully strange for her to write. A quote from the Dada Manifesto. I know, I know. Just let's focus on finding the weapon. Razor blade. This must be it. A razor blade with blood on it. I'll take that to forensics. Of course. Here you go. Wrist slit with a razor blade. Common for a suicide. Given the circumstances, I doubt it was a suicide. She was alone in here. The door was locked and latched on the inside. It could have been locked from the outside using the same trick I opened it with. Let's go back to the bedroom. So that's it. Rubens, the Dada killer. I can't believe it. Killer? My love, I... Uli, what did I say? Oscar, get him out of here. Sorry, man. Right away, Lieutenant. Hurry up. I feel awful, you did. But the evidence can't be ignored. This whole time... Engaged to the Dada killer. I ignored the signs. Don't beat yourself 
our pedant. He had us all fooled. Not you. You suspected something at Russo. I was blind. And it cost lives. May I recommend a mug of hot tea and a long rest? Let Uli and I wrap things up here. You need some sleep. Maybe you're right. You're always so thoughtful, Anna. What would I do without you? Uli, can I trust you? Finish the fight. Yes, madam. Well, Uli, let's get back to the task at hand. What's your plan, Anna? Honestly, nothing specific. Let's just give the room a thorough going over. Iris's business card. Iris Cleave's business card. Kiki Hag had a phone number. It wasn't listed on her medical records. Did you say something? I was just thinking out loud, that's all. Could you please track the location of the phone given on this card? Will do. Yes, can do. Miss Myers, I'd like to share an observation with you. Is that okay? Of course, I'd love to hear it. The case against Ruben is strong. He's a Dada artist. He lied to the lieutenant. We caught him in bed near a butcher girl. There's Dada stuff written on the shower. Maybe forensics will make this airtight, but I wonder. What are you wondering? It's strange to kill someone, then go to bed afterwards. Strange, right? Perhaps he leaped into bed when he heard you did knocking. But didn't Ruben seem a little dazed to you? You're suggesting Ruben was drugged and perhaps framed yes sedated i think it's possible judith would be relieved by your line of inquiry i say we test the theory look for any item an illicit substance could be dropped into take any glasses and bottles to forensics to be tested for traces of drugs all right i'll handle it good job showing initiative judith will be impressed speaking of which could you ask judith to call me tomorrow I'd like to participate in Ruben's interrogation. I'll give her the message. Great. Now I need to go and prepare for tomorrow. Good night, Anna. Good night. Is there blood behind that painting? I should take a closer look. Another poem. The true Dadaist. He yells and yells. She writes his voice. She prays and prays. He bends with laughter. Uli, over here. Is everything okay? What's happened? What? There's another data poem on the wall. Is that blood? I'm not sure. The color seems off, but possibly. I'd get a sample and take it to Dirk for analysis. Along with any fingerprints you find. Will do. So you didn't see this blood stain when you arrived? I didn't notice it. I was busy kicking down the door. Makes sense. Anyway, good night. Next day. Anna Meyer speaking. Anna, it's Uli. Are you calling about the interrogation? There will be no interrogation. None. It's just devastating. Has something happened? You need to see this for yourself, okay? Please, come to the station. I'll be there as fast as I can. Thank you, Anna. Brum.
Follow me. They're in the cell. They? Cell 21, down the hall. Try and remain calm, Miss Myers. Why won't anyone just tell me what's happened? There's no need to protect me. I've witnessed my fair share of violence as a reporter, you know. Is Judith already there? I'm... I'm sorry, Anna. <gasps> oh my god. Judith, no! Oh god, no! Oh god! I told you not to bring her here. Our orders were to guard the crime scene, not turn it into a wake. Shut up, Oscar, okay? They were partners. The lieutenant trusted her. She would have wanted Miss Myers here. Have a little compassion. Anna, are you okay? I've been better, to say the least. If Judith were here, she would ask us to put our emotions aside, work together, and investigate. That's exactly what I intend to do. Has Dirk seen this yet? He's on his way. So be careful with your fingerprints. Yes, I know. We'll start with Judith. May she rest in peace. This is all so overwhelming. Two weeks ago, we were drinking and laughing at Russo. Did the killer use Judith's own weapon against her? I don't see a gun in her holster. Dirk will be able to tell us more with the ballistics examination. Three shots to the chest. That would have made an awful lot of noise. Then again, there's a shooting gallery just downstairs. This dirt looks like blood that dried a while ago. Contrast that with the blood on her chest, which looks fresh. Was it left by the last person here? Any thoughts, Anna? Judith often warned me about jumping to conclusions. I'll reserve judgment until I examine Ruben. Try not to touch anything. It looks like there was a struggle. A Luger. Model 0629. Was this Judith's handgun? I would have to check the serial number, but probably, yes. She carried the Luger. Anna, I don't understand why this happened, but I'm grateful you're here. The lieutenant will be missed. This is a great loss for the Zurich police force. Dirk, we will find the man who did this. I promise. So you don't concur with Oscar's hypothesis? that Ruben killed her, then committed suicide. Is that what you think, Oscar? I say it's too soon to tell. I stand by my theory. Ruben was a sick man. That's why we have to shut down these data exhibitions. Look at what they inspire! All we know for sure is the murder weapon was a Luger. We presume belonged to Judith. Perhaps Judith wanted to discuss the events of last night with Ruben, and they had a fight. He took the lieutenant's gun and shot her. Then Ruben blew his brains out. I still have to collect fingerprints and examine the weapon to be certain. Why didn't he try and escape? Why kill himself? You're so naive, Rumi. He was a maniac serial killer. He killed all these women as a sick art project. The lieutenant caught him, so he shot her. Why didn't he escape? How could he? They were in a police station. Hmm. So he chose his cell as his final canvas. But what about... what? What, what, what? Do you have an observation to share? Are you finally ready to be a detective? Not just a stuttering lapdog? Please, stop your useless bickering at once. Didn't you learn anything from Judith? Stay focused. Dear, did you notice the wall behind Judith? The blood looks dry and crusted. Hmm, yes, agreed. I need someone to get the luminol from my laboratory while I dust for fingerprints. Luminol? What does it look like? It's a translucent blue liquid in a tube. The bottle is labeled. But please, pour some into an atomizer bottle. I need to spray the chemical on the wall. I'll find it. Just a moment. Wait, Uli, I'll go with you. I don't see either the luminol or the atomizer bottle. 
Let's look around. I found an empty atomizer bottle. Very cool. No sign of a blue chemical yet, but I did find an atomizer bottle. This must be the Lumino. Here, pour it into the atomizer. Done. Let's go back and try it. <laughs> 